to Survive Comic-Con. Navigating the ginormous annual convention Comic-Con isn't for the faint of heart. These tips from seasoned pros will help. You will need a schedule, comfortable shoes, carbs, cash, an empty bag, a poster tube, and flexibility. Optional, water bottles and snacks. Step one, decide in advance what you most want to see because there's no way to do it all. The complete schedule is posted on comic-con.org about two weeks prior to the convention. For the latest information, subscribe to the Comic-Con newsfeed, follow them on Twitter, like their Facebook page, or download their free mobile app. Step two, dress comfortably to survive Comic-Con, especially when it comes to footwear. Almost every attraction requires standing in line and waits can be several hours. And consider carbo loading the night before. Comic-Con isn't a sprint, it's a marathon. Pack water bottles and snacks so you're not at the mercy of the overpriced and underwhelming food court options. Step three, bring cash. Many vendors don't accept credit cards and the ATM lines can be long. Carry a bag for swag, preferably one you can tote hands-free, and an empty poster tube for artwork. Step four, arrive early to browse the main floor where the smaller booths are featured. That area gets unbearably crowded by midday. And no matter what the schedule says, stop by your favorite exhibitors in person. Some signings and events aren't announced in advance. Step five, if there's a popular panel you really want to see, consider attending the previous one to ensure a seat. Except for VIP sections, rooms aren't cleared between panels. Step six, be flexible. Though it's smart to have a plan to survive Comic-Con, it's even smarter to take advantage of the surprises you'll inevitably encounter. Did you know? Comic-Con is nicknamed the Nerd Prom.